A young lady who loves to fight, Cora Jade. But does she actually like skateboarding? The following is a two out of three falls match. Making her way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, Cora Jade. Amazing young talent, already won the NXT Women's Tag Titles and has main evented a number of times as a singles competitor as well. If Cora wins tonight, maybe she'll do some skating after the match. Or maybe she'll crack that skateboard over your back. WWE veteran who's appeared to be hitting her stride recently. But listen, Dana Brooke has been synonymous with the 24-7 championship, and she recalibrated her career direction. Right now, Dana Brooke is fully focused. Well, I think that's the problem. I think Dana pays too much attention to the WWE Universe. Dana Brooke needs to take care of business. Tremendous energy and desire. She's hoping to solidify her, her position in the championship mix. Courageous, gutsy, and getting stronger every day in her climb to the top. In a two out of three falls match, the superstars are usually very comparable. And that's certainly the case here, Byron. Well, two out of three falls matches are usually between competitors who have traded victories. And that's good news for the WWE Universe because they often get three matches in one. These two match up well tonight, but when someone's feeling it, they can bulldoze the opponent in two straight falls, and that's all she wrote. We'll see how this one shakes out. Handstand into the elbow drop. Oh. Now just attacking the opponent's back. Looks like Dana Brooke has a little swagger in her step tonight. the leg here. And Dana is having her way right now. Core is getting knocked back at every turn. Up and down. Brutal. Oh, a step up in Zagari. Oh, look at her answering back. We've seen some historic matches take place inside Hell in a Cell. This has to be an added pressure for these competitors. Yeah, Cole, there's a high bar to meet when you agree to this match. But you can't focus on what's been done before you. You have to keep your sights locked on your opponent. Oh, man! a well-placed punch. She's in the ring now. Cora with an opening to go high. Answering back! Ooh. Ooh. Oh, what a knee! Can she score the pin? She kicks out at one. Clearly, she's still got a lot of fight left in her. And Dana gets stolen. Ooh, what a fair club. Oh, what a hip toss. Oh, that was nice. Cover, cover. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Out of the ring and into hell itself. The WWE Universe always says they want tables, 
It looks like he's giving them what they want. Stop your opponent. She's losing some steam now. This is what Hell in a Cell is all about. You have to be able to endure this kind of punishment if you want the victory. Oh, oh my! Oh, man. Something nefarious is beneath the ring. If you're going to grab a kendo stick, you better be prepared to use it. She heads into the ring. She's getting something from under the ring. Oh, my God. A sledgehammer. This is going too far. She turns it right around. Oh, here we go. Jade's demise. Two. She sneaks a fall there. Boom. Oh. Face buster. Man, that was vicious. Dana Brooke. Big mistake there, Corey. Well, she knows that now. Hey, fuck. Uh oh. Able to parry that one. Hurricanrana. From the top. Jade Sentai. Can Jade close things out? There's two. She gets a fall. Disrupt that attack. Uh oh. We're gonna see it. Power. Sit down. Powerbomb. She's got the shoulders down. Got it. A career changing win inside Hell in a Cell. Here is your winner, Dana Brooke. Love seeing her get the win. And it was a big match for her. I'll hang my hat on the win of that caliber any day of the week. This is one to be proud of.